I feel like it, it, there's just like we had mentioned, there is, there's information overload. There's so much noise out there that you can come with one thing or a handful of things and talk to the leader or the team about it. But if you don't show them how to sequence it and how to fit it all together, it's just not going to stick. Do you know what I mean, Charlie? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I think um, I've so many examples in my career where, you know, um, there have been, I'll just say, objectives or um, targets that have been just communicated down, you know, from the highest levels of the organization, maybe without full knowledge of, you know, what it takes to execute those and you're handed those. And if you can't break some of those often complex targets down into some manageable components that you can get the team rallied around and working toward, then at a minimum, it's going to be tremendously difficult to accomplish those. And the heavy lifting that people are going to have to do is not going to be sustainable. Or, you know, um, in the worst case, you're you're just not going to be able to hit those objectives. So I think, um, you know, having some more open dialogue on, you know, like, how do we as a team, whatever the size or whatever, you know, that team is or, or the multi-layer team, how, how do we work together to ensure success? If this is, you know, if this is like the mid to high level vision, or, or if these are the, you know, targets that, you know, um, you know, for-profit organizations lay out, what can we do? to hold up our end of the bargain and what's our part that we can contribute to that and work together to really figure out what is that contribution going to be? How, what's the size and timing of it? And then how do we really, you know, ensure that we can be successful with that? And then it comes down to, you know, what's really the right work that we need to do and focus on to support that 